Hello guys, it's me again, and uh, this is Kane OS on the Raspberry Pi 2. So you might know Kane OS from those Kit Kano Kit PCs, which were made for kids, so they could learn programming and you know computers stuff like that. They could get in, yeah, invented with the Raspberry Pi. So here it is on the Raspberry Pi 2. Uh, so normally I do, first of all, uh, menu speed, second level. Uh, browser speed, then the text writer speed, and then the looks. So let's do that. Uh, menu speed. Pretty fast. No problem with it. Sometimes it's stuck. But you know. That's okay. Um, yeah. Like, it's fast enough for kids. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. I think it's fast enough. It's uh, pretty good, you know, it looks good. So, then the browser speed. I, um, Chromium was pre-installed, although it's a, kind of an outdated version, so I'm not very glad with that. But okay, it does its job. As long as you don't watch videos, everything does fine. What? There we go. Works fine. Nothing wrong with it. Only that it doesn't play videos. Then I tried to install um, Ice Weasel, and it worked through the terminal. But of course, uh, KNOS has to store there are like 40 apps or something. But it doesn't have an icon. And I see the reason why they did that because it's easier for children that to see these icons. And I don't know. But here you have it, Ice Weasel on Kino OS. Um, it's just like Firefox, but then for Vespian or Kino OS or whatever. Works also pretty good, I would say. Internet has not, uh, never been really fast on Raspberry Pi, but it does a job. You might even uh, watch like really really easy videos that would be possible I think okay so browsing fine I wouldn't use browsing for a uh, Kano OS like I would install uh, I don't know Ubuntu or something but it's for kids so that's not fair to say text document yes but it's uh, it's pretty fair well LibreOffice there you go Wow, works pretty good. A lot of kids would use this. Well, I don't know. Probably. Then the looks. The looks is where this OS is like the best. Man, it's it's so you can easily see this for kids. It's pretty cool because you can level up. The more things you do, if you uh, like Minecraft or Pong or Snake, if you make things in that, you get experience and you level up. That's so awesome for kids. It's like an OS game. It's pretty cool. You can make stuff, and then you level up, and you're like, Hey, what level are you in Kano OS? Oh, I'm level 3. Oh, yeah, you're such a good programmer. That's so awesome. I like that. I like Kano OS. It might not be the fastest or, you know, the most useful OS, but for kids it is. It's pretty cool. So, yeah. Uh, that was Kano OS, just on the Raspberry Pi 2. It works. Works pretty good. Um, has good multi-core uh, enable thing, <laughs> uh, uses most of his RAM, so yeah, thanks for watching, I'll see you guys in the next video, bye.